So, uh, 2021 uh, breeding season I'm gonna start today is March uh, 23rd. So I got, I'm gonna start uh, trimming my birds. I already started doing uh, some birds. So what do you need? I'm gonna show you how I do it. So you need just your scissors, a basin where you can uh, chop the feathers off, and a bucket of water with a little bit of bleach. I already trimmed one of the yellows. Okay, I'm gonna show how to do it. So I put him in the water, he's sitting there for a few minutes. So, so I'm gonna pick him up from the bucket. He's wet. Make sure his feet are clean. See, he has a poop in his leg. I make sure everything is clean. So, it's not bad. Looks pretty decent. So, that's it. Start to trim. I don't trim too close. I leave like an inch to the half so I can pull it. When it's when I had to pull it. And I do a little bit of the feather wing wing tips too. And the most important I do is the cushions. See the cushions? I trim all the cushions so they get a better contact. I wet it there too because if it's not wet, it's gonna fly everywhere and gonna be mess when you breathe, it goes into your nose. So I trim that too, still it flies. Okay, some people use a trimmer, like a thing which you, which you can trim your beard, everything, to trim this area. Yeah, but the scissors does a good job. You make sure that wherever he is gonna meet and his contact areas, it uh, it is clear so he can get a better contact when uh, mating. Okay, good luck everybody for the 2021 breeding season. So I just put them into an individual cage for pairing up. My daughter calls him son of warrior and the yellow she calls Queen of Arabia. So this is our first pair. pair. This is her favorite pair. So what we're going to just feed some feed in a small and grip. That's it. In a few days they'll be paired up. Yeah. Then we're going to give them a nest ball. Something like that. So they're gonna be here for a few days until they get mated up properly, then I will move them into the main coop. <laughs> 